Please like, subscribe, and share for more videos. Nathan is a taxi driver. He doesn't have much money, so he doesn't own a taxi. Nathan works for a big taxi company, and the company owns the taxis. Every day, Nathan drives a different taxi. Despite being a very handsome man, he receives many invitations for dates from women, but he always says no. The reason behind his refusals is his deep love for a woman named Grace Vincent Stevens. Nathan's love for Grace is unique, he has never spoken to her, and he can't, as she exists only in a picture. Grace's portrait is displayed in the City Art Gallery, and Nathan visits it every day. His routine involves arriving at work at 5 a.m., an hour before his shift, to clean his taxi. Nathan dislikes the fact that many drivers don't clean their taxis after work, so he takes it upon himself to do so before starting his day. After work, Nathan heads to the art gallery, where he spends time admiring Grace's portrait. He even bought a catalog with a photograph of the painting and keeps it next to his bed. In his dreams, Nathan envisions a relationship with Grace, although he is aware that Grace Vincent Stevens died in 1927. Despite the seemingly irrational nature of his love, Nathan has never shared this secret with anyone. One day, while cleaning a taxi, Nathan finds an earring on the floor. He recognizes it and remembers seeing a similar earring in Grace's portrait. Instead of reporting the finding, Nathan decides to find the owner himself. He contemplates the earring's potential value, and after some thought, he remembers seeing Grace's earrings in the catalog. The next day, Nathan decides to search for the owner of the earring. He waits outside a hotel, believing that someone from the previous night's taxi rides might have lost it. As he waits, he reflects on his efforts and feels unsure of his chances. Eventually, he decides to seek guidance from Grace Vincent by returning to the art gallery. Inside the gallery, Nathan is surprised to find a young woman, Barbara, standing in front of Grace's portrait, crying and talking to it. Barbara reveals that she comes from a small town near Tupa, worked in a local shop, and saved money to move to the city. She shares her recent experience of wearing her mother's earrings on a date, only to lose one of them. Realizing that Barbara is the owner of the earring, Nathan offers it to her. Barbara is amazed and grateful, considering it a miracle. She expresses her intention to visit the gallery often and thanks her great-grandmother, believing that Grace Vincent's spirit guided Nathan to find her. Nathan, overwhelmed with joy, invites Barbara for coffee. As they leave the gallery, he waves goodbye to Grace Vincent, convinced that the woman in the painting smiles and waves back at him.